basketball, sweetheart. Today is a big day. I'm so excited that I get to marry my best friend and begin our new lives together as husband and wife. I'm not even nervous about all the people that are here to celebrate this with us. Everyone that we love and share a part of our daily lives is with us here today to support us. It is wild to think that we are coming up on six years of us being together. I recall our first date like it was just yesterday. You know that I'm horrible with remembering dates, but I will never forget on the 24th of June, 2014, when I asked you to be my girlfriend and you actually said yes. I think I was in shock. And little did I know at the time how my life would be forever changed. I love you so much, Marissa. You are all that I'll ever need. Well, babe, I think it's almost that time, and I can't wait to meet you at the end of the aisle. I love you, Marissa, Nicole West, your loving husband. Brandon is your father. I've always made it a point to know how loved and appreciated you are. You know how much you mean to me and how important you are to me in my life. Having sons has been the greatest blessing in my life. Over the years, I've taught you many things and you have grown into your own person. So I thought I would take this opportunity to sing your praises a little bit. For being you, a loving, caring, passionate, and extremely persistent son. Becoming an Eagle Scout, graduating from high school, going on a mission to the Balkan oil fields in North Dakota. Being a father to the most beautiful princesses ever born, Ava and Olivia. And finally, today, marrying the love of your life. From the moments our paths crossed, you've surprised me, captivated me, distracted me, and challenged me in a way that no human ever has. You've lifted me up when I've fallen, held my hand through all the bad times, and been by my side through all the good. You have been my biggest supporter and my greatest cheerleader. I love you because you are always so happy and so positive, so adventurous and strong. I love your selflessness, your outgoing personality, and your determination. You're the love of my life, and you make me happier than I could have ever imagined, and more loved than I ever thought was possible. You make me so unbelievably proud, and I promise to make you proud as your wife. You are such an amazing dad, and I can't wait to watch you walk your little girls down the aisle on their wedding day. You have my whole entire heart for the rest of forever, and I promise to be true to you, to uplift you, to support you, to frustrate you and challenge you, I promise to always encourage your dreams and help shoulder our challenges. I promise to value our differences just as much as our common ground. I promise to put all my effort into strengthening our marriage and always giving you the best version of myself. Now don't be late. I will see you at the end of the aisle where the start of our forever awaits us. Love, your wife. One of my biggest prayers for Brandon was answered, that he would find someone who would love him and appreciate him. This special person would be a great partner for him for the rest of his life. Thank you, Marissa, for being that 
special person in Brandon's life. Marissa, I give you this ring. Marissa, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love and faithfulness. As a symbol of my love and faithfulness. And with this ring, I thee wed. And with this ring, I thee wed. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And the Son. And the Son. And the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit. Brandon, I give you this ring. Brandon, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love and faithfulness. As a symbol of my love and faithfulness. And with this ring, and with this ring, I thee wed. I thee wed. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And the Son. And the Son. And the Holy Spirit. And the Holy Spirit. We did it. We made it through all the struggles of wedding planning and we made it through this crazy thing called life without killing each other. We have come so far from where we first started and it's crazy to think that was almost seven years ago. I still remember the first time I saw you. I was very quiet and kept to my circle. Then I looked over and see a very tall, very loud guy at the other end of the bar, just having the time of his life. And I can remember thinking to myself, that guy looks like a ton of fun to be around. By the powers vested in me by the state of Florida and as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, I pronounce that you are now husband and wife in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. What God has joined together, let no one separate. Brandon, you may now kiss your wife. Bruce and Brandon, congratulations to you both. Your marriage is blessed on a strong foundation of faith, respect, admiration, and love for each other. With these ingredients, your journey as wife, husband, mom, and dad are set to carry you through life. Let us raise a glass to celebrate Brandon and my new daughter, Marissa.